What is up guys, today I will show you how to refresh your Samsung, how to make it faster, how to clear actually the cache here after each update, what you must do. Uh, otherwise you will have some issues like I had, for example, draining battery or sometimes it's just rebooted or even has some lags here on my Galaxy S23 Ultra. It's suitable for any Samsung phone, any Galaxy phone and you must do it after each update. I really believe that it's helping and I feel how it's helping. The battery life is improved and actually the work of the phone is improved. So currently, as you see, I've got One UI 8 and after our One UI 8 update, uh, I actually didn't do it. So now I will show you uh, how to clear the cache here how, and how to do it faster. So let's follow it one by one. Firstly, what you need is to have the cable here. I have it with me and you need to connect your phone to any laptop including the MacBook or any other. So here I have my MacBook here. Uh, let's connect it uh, to the laptop. So as you see it's connected then just to go to power menu click power and power off. So currently device is power off. You will hear some vibrations and what you need to do is to turn it on. Now what you need to do is to press two buttons at the same time, volume up and power on button. And when you see the Samsung logo, you should just stop uh, pressing it. So one, two, three, click. Then wait, 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 wait until logo will appear. Then just uh, stop clicking it and wait until you will launch the menu. Okay, so as you see, it's launched here. Uh, I don't know whether you see it clearly, but now you have several options. Reboot the system, reboot the bootloader, apply updates from ADB, and wipe data factory reset, and wipe cache portions here. Partition, actually. Mount system, view recovery logs, run graphic tests, run locale, locale test, and power off. So data factory reset, I don't recommend you to do, but wipe cache par partitions here. It's actually quite nice to do it each time after you made any update or significant, especially when you switch from one, one UI version to another. Then how to operate here? You need to use volume up, volume down. Go volume down to wipe ca cache partition. Click on it. Uh, this wipe cache, this can be done. Click. Yes, select by power button. Okay, as you see here, cache wiping complete, then just reboot system very fast. It takes only one minute to do it. Uh, and after this, just wait until it will be loaded. And it actually will work faster, the battery life should be better. And in general, after each update, it's must do. So let me just show you that everything will be fine and it's not really risky to do it. It's nothing changing your phone. Just clear some cache and some rubbish uh, that was before. Uh, so I'll put my password. Then you already can disconnect it from your laptop. Put it aside. Then it's loading. So as you see loaded, working well. Even after it starts, it's already visible that it's working fast. Usually you need some time after restarting, but even now it's working well. And I really recommend to do it each time after update. In case you still have some questions, just put them in the comments below, put the thumbs up and see you next time.